Hey guys, I'm Kelvin from Raw Coding. Today, I'll be talking about social media options on your Wix website. Hi guys, I'm currently in the Wix editor and today I'll be talking about adding social links to your website. I've created a page titled social links at the top and I'll be running through the various aspects of social links on Wix. To add a social link, press add on the left, go under social, and you will have various social media linking options to choose from. These options are basically split up into two categories. The social bars at the top allow you to link your social media web pages to each icon, whereas these tools, the Facebook likes and the share buttons, encourage users to like your Facebook page through their accounts. So first of all, I'm just going to drag a social bar into the editor. To add your social links, double click on the bar and then you can choose which links you would like to have displayed. So if we delete Google+, Pinterest, and only leave Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook on there, you can add your social media page links just on the right over here. So currently they're connected to Wix, but if you add your page links in this box, the user will be directed to your page whenever they click on the specific icon. And now if you click on Facebook, it will take you to the Wix Facebook page connected to the Facebook button on your website. Let's just go out of that, go back to editor, click on add. Now the other option you have is adding a Facebook like to your web page. The user will have to be actively logged into Facebook to like your website and your page will need to be published for this to work. So if we click publish, go on view site, this is what it, the website looks like online. We scroll down and click like it will bring up an option for the user to sign in on their Facebook account. Once they've signed in, a like will be added to this little box over here. So this basically gives your users an indication on how many people are interacting with this website. If you do have a lot of users that interact with your website and you do get quite a lot of likes in this little box, it may encourage a more positive response from your users. If we just go out of this and go back to our editor, press add, so the rest of these social buttons basically work the same as the Facebook like box. You have a Facebook share option, which allows users to share your website on their Facebook page. If we go down, you have the same thing on Twitter and on Pinterest. And you can also encourage your users to subscribe to your YouTube channel by embedding this button into your website. With this button over here, you just have to set your YouTube channel URL and when the users click on subscribe, it will basically subscribe their YouTube channel to yours. If we go back on add, the last thing you can do is show your Facebook pages feed inside your website. So this basically shows your users what's going on on your Facebook page. To see how it works, I'm just going to drag it into the editor. To add your Facebook page to this box, double click on it, type in your Facebook page ID. So mine is raw coding, press enter and it will switch it to my Facebook page. To show you, I'm going to press preview and your users will be able to like your Facebook page directly and share this Facebook page on their Facebook account. So this concludes adding social links to your website. This is only a small aspect of your web design, but encouraging your users to interact with your social media apps can provide fantastic results for your business website or personal blog. And I hope this video covered the basics on how to use your social media apps on your website. If you are interested in joining Wix, please do click on the link in this video description below. It basically tells Wix that you joined through me and helps me out a lot. Thank you so much for watching the video and if you would like to see more tutorials on Wix, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye. Oh.